Hi everybody, I'm Brad. I'm Krista. From the Big Family Homestead, and today we are making something that is so tasty, I can't even say the words. So you're gonna have to. Broccoli cheese soup. It's good, let's get to it. Yes, oh yes, your ears have not deceived you. We are making broccoli cheese soup, and um, this is kinda, it started out as like a knockoff recipe from the Panera Bread recipe. Now, this is not the Panera Bread, so we're not gonna get lawsuits. This is lawsuits, right? No lawsuits. No. We basically kind of deconstructed it, and, and, and I think, well, what do you think? I think it's better. I really do think it's better, <laughs> honestly. And, and it's better for a lot of reasons. Not only just the taste, but there's no nasty wasty chemicals. It's all basic from scratch stuff that you can do. And trust me, you can do it. It'll change you. Look at it. Change you like it changed me. And it's really fast and easy for those quick meals that you have to do. Throw up and, well. Will you throw up no, you when don't you make throw these up. meals? Eh. Forget I'll show it. you the ingredients. Let's get going. <laughs> Okay, like most of the recipes we do here, everything is easy from scratch, basic, basic stuff. So we've got one whole onion diced. We have one stick of butter, which is one half cup butter. We have one third cup flour, six cups of whole milk, and that is important because there are recipes that will use uh, um, heavy cream, but whole milk gives you a nice consistency without getting too thick and gloopy, usually. We need four heads of broccoli cut into florets, a little pinch of nutmeg, never hurt anybody. You need four cups of grated cheese. We like the cheddar, the sh you know sharp cheddar, so tasty. We also need a small dash of salt, some freshly ground pepper, and the chicken broth over here. That is in case your consistency is a little bit off and you wanna make sure that it's not too thick. You add that, it gives you a little flavor and it keeps you all straight when it comes to the consistency. Yeah. Hey baby, what hey. you doing? Making cheese soup. Oh, yeah. Broccoli cheese soup. Broccoli that cheese is. soup. Yeah. So we got what? We got going we got on. Got our butter melting. Butter melting. Melted. Melted. And yeah. next? Onion goes in. Onion goes in. Saute that up. Oh, yummy. Yummy. All right, hot stuff. What's next? Well, now that you've got your onions sauteed a bit, you add your flour. So you're going to make a roux. A roux. A roux. Yes. A roux for you. Yes. Right. You gotta cook it just a few minutes to get that flour taste out of there. Okay, so this has been cooking for a couple minutes to get rid of that nasty flour taste. We're gonna add our milk. Six cups. Six cups of whole, whole milk. milk. Yummy. So now we're just gonna bring this to a simmer and then you're gonna add your nutmeg, your broccoli, and your salt and pepper. So now we're gonna add our nutmeg and I just grate it into the soup to where it looks like it's about a pinch. Yeah, that'll do. And you toss your broccoli in there. Pinch of salt. Bit of pepper. And you get that simmering for about 20 minutes till it cooks the broccoli down some. Yay! Yay! You did that so well, honey. Thank you, dear. That's awesome. Stirring my brew. This is gonna be tasty. Uh-oh, look out, we got fogged. Okay, so now we're at the point where it's all, the broccoli is almost cooked. The sauce is getting really thick now. So we're going to get our immersion blender. We're gonna grind up this broccoli just a bit so that we don't have such big, humongous pieces. No, no huge pieces. No. But we don't want it obliterated either. Okay, so this is kind of what we're looking at. Where you still have some big pieces, it's not complete mush. You still have nice big pieces in there. Oh, yummy. Yeah. Hey. Now it's cheesy time. Yay, cheese! Yay! My favorite! In you go, cheese. So I put about half of it in there first, melt that down, and then I add the other half. If you need it. If you need it. If you want it less cheesy, then you add less cheese. But who the heck would want less cheese? I don't get that. That's just crazy. That is un-American. Yeah, it is. All right, that's all melted now. Let's add the rest of the cheese. Yeah. Oh, true. Yay. I need a piece. Huh. Sneaker. 
Oh, look at that. Yummy, yummy. So now, if you like your broccoli cheese soup thick yeah, like check this, that out. look at how thick that is. Yep. That looks really good. However, our family likes it just a touch thinner. So we're going to add a bit of chicken broth to it. Chicken broth. Okay. Just add a little bit at a time until you get the right consistency that you want. Yes, sir. Yes, Ooh. sir. Three bags full. Oh, yummy. Oh, a little more, Mama. Hit it with a little more. All right. I think we'll do it. That'll do That'll it. Do oh, it. yeah. Do you see how easy that is? That is just... And this whole thing was done in, what, 30 minutes or less? Oh, 15 tops. I mean, this is one of those really quick dinners that's meatless if you want to have a meatless meal. We do that once in a while. And it's done. Done. Done, done, done. Would you feast your eyes upon this wonder of wonders and delight of delights? Oh, we get now to eat it, yay! All right, party people of YouTube, feast your eyes upon this. Oh, it's time. Get in there, mama. Get you some. Yay! <laughs> Broccoli cheese soup, here we go. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh, huh, huh, huh. So yummy. And you know, it's easy to do, guys. Mm -hmm. There's no funky chemicals in there, and uh, you don't have to pay, like, whatever it is, you know, $8 billion for it at Pantera Bread. That's ridiculous. Anyway. It takes you longer to go there, go there to get it than to make it. Got to get down with the soup. Mm -hmm. I'm Brad. I'm Krista. Big Family Homestead. Keeping it real. Oh, yeah. Have an amazing day. Yeah. <laughs>